how's it guys welcome to my home studio my name is kelly and on my channel i like to share planner videos art videos recipes crafts diys mixed media happy meal and hauls fountain pens and fountain pen ink and sometimes i will throw in a lifestyle video so if any of those genres sound appealing to you i hope you do consider subscribing to my channel and have a delectable and delightful haul from cultpens.com this is the entire diamine shimmer line with the exception of the four that they were out of stock of and then promptly the very next day they had it back in stock and the seven that i already own but don't you worry i have the other four and i got them from someplace else because I had ordered them in the meantime, and then the next day they told me, I got an email, and it said that they were back in stock. So it was probably something um, haywire on the website. So, without further ado, let's take a look at the K for Kelly. Yay! <laughs> Guys, so I rearranged them, and I think... This is very aesthetically pleasing to my eye. So this is how we're going to do our show and tell here. So first up, I have this beauty. And it is... These are all of the Shimmer inks, mind you. They're all made by Diamine. And this is called Enchanted Ocean. Let's see if you can see it from the cap. Oh, look, there's a huge hunk. So this definitely needs shaken. Not stirred. <laughs> so, in any event, I will do that. Because who wants to waste any of that goodness? Okay, so there's that one. And next up, we have this beauty. This one is called Golden Sands. Beautiful. Look at that. I love all the shimmer ink. I have a few favorite brands so far, but I think overall top tier position goes to Diamine for me. I just really have enjoyed them for several years. So, All right. Oh, let's see if you can see it on the cap. You can see it in the bottle. Okay. Uh-oh, and it's all over. Let's just rub it in for posterity, shall we? Oh, I do not think that cap is on right. And believe me when I say, oh, that is nice. Look at that. I do not want to waste any ink, but... You know, sometimes there are casualties in when you play with ink, unfortunately. Okay, so there's that one. And you got a really good look at that color. And then this one is called Pearl Blue. Or excuse me, rather, Blue Pearl. Very pretty. Oh, that is going to be a stunner. It is so dark. Beautiful. And I will be doing swatches. I'm setting up. Here you go. Look how deep that is. Um setting up a new swatch book so well my first swatch book in fact Ooh, night sky oh yeah look at that that is some thickums in that jar this has some sediment and it's been sitting obviously i'm gonna shake all of these later 
because I don't want to make a huge mess. Arctic blue. I just can't help myself. This is so gorgeous. Oh, and this is a thickums too. There's that one. And this one is called Red Luster. You guys. Red used to be my favorite color. Ooh. It's an orangey red. Ooh. The bottle. Ooh. Beautiful. It's really hard to tell online what things look like and sometimes you just get surprises in a good way i mean i never really met a color i didn't like so this is called moon dust a friend of mine got me spearmint years ago as a gift years many moons ago that's a nice gray thickums again on the lid good for us Bad for the ink. Oh, purple pizzazz. Let's see what we have behind door number one. Oh, that's unusual. Look at that. And since they've been obviously sitting for quite some time, they got thick like that. So you definitely want to give them a shake. Good thing ink lasts for years. Coco Shimmer. Because, and that was a surprise, because I would have never thought that to be purple pizzazz, but it is. All right, what are we doing? Coco Shimmer. All right, this one looks beautiful. Okay, so next on the list is Cobalt Jazz. And I would not have guessed that from seeing the bottom of it there. Oh, so this has a definitive green undertone, this blue. Nice. That's going to be fun. A really fun one. Yeah, see that? See the blue here on the outskirts and the green there? Okay, blue lightning. Ooh la la, that is some thick thickums. Beautiful. And then we have this one, Neon Lime. Hello, welcome to my world. Look how stunning. There you go, look at that. Nice. And then we have Rockin' Rio. So it's a red. Yeah. You're going to have quite the range of colors in this line. All right, we have Sparkling Shadows. Remember that 70s show, Dark Shadows? My sister used to watch that, my older sister. The Night Gallery. Beautiful. 
Then we have Shimmering Seas. Look at that. Then we have this stunner. This is called Electric Pink. You know I'm all for that. Oh yeah, look at that. Hello, beautiful. And Dragon Blood. Oh yeah, it should be a nice red. With the thick spot there. It shows more orangey there, but I imagine once it gets shaken, it's going to be a nice red. Yeah. Okay. Then we have Wine Divine. Ooh. And then Golden Ivy, which I've used this one. This is beautiful. I filled up my new pen with this. My, pel my first Pelican M400 tortoiseshell. Gorgeous. And then we have Pink Champagne. Mm. And next is Starlet Sea. There you go. Nice thick little blob there. Look at this one. This is called Firestorm Red. Hello. I'm just, I love all colors, but red used to be my very favorite one, like I said. And red is mm, it's a, quite a statement piece in writing, especially. All right. Citrus Ice. Beautiful. I like to watch the ink move in the bottles. There's just something mesmerizing about it. That's pretty. Then we have Peacock Flare. Well, so far I like all of them. That is really pretty. So I hope you will like this little show and tell of all the colors so you can see what's out there. Tropical Glow. You can see it a little bit better like this. That's pretty. This is called Blue Flame. Ooh, look at that like bronze color inside that. So once you shake it up, that blue is going to be quite amazing. Then we have Mystique, which is a purple, but it hasn't been shaken. So let's see what the undertone is. Yeah. It's a, like a bronzy undertone in that green, even a deep forest green, mossy green. And then this one is pink glitz. Mm. 
that's going to be pretty. And then last but not least, we have Firefly. Look at that in the bottle. Even. See what I mean? Some of them, they're just, they're fun to watch move. And that's the undertone, obviously, in that one. Nice and orange. Okay, and then upcoming, I will have my swatches coming and my swatch book flip through and all that good kind fun stuff. So this is just a short video to show you the Diamine Shimmer inks. And if you liked what you saw, I hope you do consider subscribing to my channel and I wish you folks all a very beautiful day. Peace out.